Throughout the ages, many thinkers have emphasized the vital role of discretion and the messages conveyed through silence. They recognized that not every thought or experience merits public expression. The philosopher Lao Tzu once remarked, He who knows others is wise, he who knows himself is enlightened. This quote invites us to reflect on the importance of understanding ourselves as we navigate our interactions with the world. It encourages a journey towards self-awareness, where we learn the profound impact of what we choose to share and what we decide to keep private. With that in mind, let's embark on a journey to uncover seven valuable lessons that guide us toward wisdom and strength by encouraging us to keep certain thoughts private. Number one, avoid negative self-talk. One of the essential lessons in cultivating resilience revolves around refraining from speaking poorly about yourself. Dismissing your own value and abilities can create a self-destructive cycle that can be hard to escape. Consider this. Every time you think or say, I'm not good enough, or I'll never achieve that, you are not just voicing doubts. You are actively chipping away at your own confidence and sense of self-worth. This negative self-talk can be like a weight dragging down your potential, holding you back from embracing opportunities that could lead to personal growth. To alter this pattern, start by challenging harmful thoughts as they arise. A better approach would be to remind yourself of past achievements, the steps you are taking to improve, and the support you have. For instance, envision a time when you faced a similar challenge and successfully handled it, or recall praise you received for your efforts. Instead of succumbing to self-pity, adopt affirmations that reinforce a positive self-image. Phrases such as, I am capable of growth, or every day I'm getting stronger, can significantly shift your mindset. By replacing negative statements with constructive ones, you foster a more nurturing inner dialogue, which can ignite determination and foster personal growth. Think of it this way. If you wouldn't tolerate negative comments from others, why would you permit them from yourself? Just as we wouldn't allow detractors to chip away at our confidence, we must guard our self-talk vigilantly and strive for a strong foundation for progress and a positive outlook. Number two, keep personal growth private. As you work on becoming the best version of yourself, consider the wisdom of Confucius. The man who moves a mountain begins by carrying away small stones. This means that progress is often gradual and intensely personal. It can be tempting to shout about our latest achievements. After all, isn't it human nature to seek validation? However, constantly boasting about your progress risks diluting the sincerity of your growth. When we seek applause for our efforts, we can become overly attached to others' perceptions and opinions, detracting from the intrinsic value of our personal journeys. Instead, embrace your journey quietly. Allow your evolution to become apparent through your actions and behavior rather than through grand announcements. When others observe your transformation organically, they may feel inspired to follow suit, which often has a more profound impact than mere words can convey. You don't need applause. Simply focus on your aspirations and the goals you wish to manifest. Think of it like a plant quietly growing in a garden. Without loud declarations, it flourishes and eventually blossoms into something beautiful. Not only does this approach cultivate a sense of humility, but it also represents an authentic connection to the process of self-improvement. By valuing growth in silence, 
You encourage a deeper appreciation for the small wins along the way, creating momentum that drives you toward larger successes. Number 3. The Art of Moderation Balancing our habits is a vital piece of the puzzle in leading a fulfilling life. Overindulgence can lead to various adverse effects, both physically and mentally. Think about it. When was the last time you overindulged in something, whether it be food, sleep or entertainment, only to feel worse for it later? Just like filling your plate until it overflows, constant excess neglects the experience of truly enjoying something. The Stoics, particularly Aristotle, underscored moderation as a virtue that could significantly enhance our quality of life. When it comes to food, for example, savouring each bite can lead to a more fulfilling culinary experience. Rather than stuffing yourself until discomfort arises, aim to eat until you're satisfied. This approach can enhance not just your physical health, but also your mental and emotional well-being. It encourages mindfulness, enabling you to appreciate the flavors and experiences that food offers, rather than seeing it as merely sustenance. This philosophy can extend far beyond meals. We should adopt moderation in our work, friendships and leisure activities as well. Think about your screen time. Many people find their time consumed by mindless scrolling through social media. Recognizing the middle ground between abstaining completely from pleasures and excessive indulgence is crucial in ensuring a balanced life. The principle of moderation encourages us to set healthy limits. Whether it's integrating time for self-care into a busy schedule or choosing to engage in hobbies that are meaningful to us, finding that equilibrium can lead to a more enriched life. Instead of sacrificing one aspect of life for another, moderation promotes a more nuanced and fulfilling experience. Recognizing that less can indeed be more is one of the cornerstones that can lead to a more gratifying life. Number 4. The Power of Listening In today's society, where everyone seems eager to share their story, it's easy to overlook the profound impact of being a good listener. Often attributed to the American author Dale Carnegie, the saying, you can make more friends in two months by becoming interested in other people than in two years trying to get other people interested in you, reinforces the notion that listening opens doors to connection. This lesson can be particularly significant in both personal and professional realms. In an age where distractions abound, practicing active listening becomes an increasingly essential skill. Listening attentively not only enhances your understanding of others, but also builds stronger connections. When somebody opens up, they're often sharing something deeply personal. Genuine engagement demonstrates that you value their thoughts and feelings. Listening is an investment in the relationship. Picture yourself in a heartfelt conversation. By being fully present and responding thoughtfully, the bond of mutual respect grows stronger. Whether you're in a meeting or having coffee with a friend, take notice every time you listen actively. This practice generates trust and invites deeper conversations, revealing insights into your own beliefs and perceptions. Interestingly, listening can also be a source of personal growth. Engaging attentively with different viewpoints provides a larger perspective on various issues. This willingness to listen helps us confront our biases and broaden our understanding. In the grand tapestry of life, listening stitches, threads of connection, community and empathy, creating a rich fabric of shared experiences. Number 5. Stay grounded in the present. 
Life unfolds in a series of present moments, and it can be all too easy to get caught up in worries about the future or regrets about the past. The Stoics remind us of the futility in becoming overly fixated on what lies ahead. Take a moment and think about your daily life. How often do you find yourself anxious about an upcoming event? To genuinely engage with life, we must learn to focus on our current circumstances and embrace what we can control. Adopting mindful practices such as meditation or grounding exercises can help us reconnect with the present moment. This shift in focus allows us to appreciate the richness of our experiences without being overshadowed by concerns about the future. For instance, a student overwhelmed by thoughts about an upcoming examination may find it more productive to concentrate on effective study habits each day. Taking things one step at a time can alleviate a sense of overwhelm and help clarify our goals. By realizing that while we can plan for the future, staying present can lead to more immediate accomplishments, we reduce the mental burden often tied to our expectations. Understandably, concerns and aspirations are part of life, but remember they shouldn't overshadow the present's richness. Appreciate the blessings and contributions of today, no matter how small. Each moment holds the potential for joy, discovery and connection. Embracing today may lead you toward tomorrow's success. Number 6. Recognize and appreciate. Appreciating the people and moments in our lives is one of the simplest yet most powerful practices we can adopt. It's easy to fall into the trap of taking things for granted, which can harm relationships and diminish our overall sense of happiness. The modern philosopher and author Brené Brown has spoken extensively about the importance of gratitude, stating, Recognizing what you have is the foundation for all abundance. When we express ingratitude, we risk distancing ourselves from the people around us. It can lead to misunderstandings, hurt feelings, and a strained social atmosphere. In contrast, Expressing gratitude fosters positive relationships and creates an environment where people feel appreciated and valued. To cultivate a habit of gratitude, start small. Write a thank you note, share a kind word, or embrace moments of gratitude during your day. To cultivate a habit of gratitude, start small. Write a thank you note share a kind word, or embrace moments of gratitude during your day. Here's an exercise you can try. At the end of each day, take a few minutes to write down three things for which you're grateful. They can be as simple as a delicious cup of coffee or a smile from a stranger. Over time, this practice helps you recognize the beauty around you and encourages a positive mindset making it easier to appreciate even the smallest joys. As you strengthen your ability to recognize and appreciate the kindness and support you receive, you'll cultivate a deeper sense of fulfillment. Not only does expressing gratitude enrich your perspective, but it also positively impacts those around you, promoting an atmosphere of appreciation and warmth. Your thankfulness can create ripples of goodwill, encouraging others to express their gratitude too. As you strengthen your ability to recognize and appreciate the kindness and support you receive, you'll cultivate a deeper sense of fulfillment. Not only does expressing gratitude enrich your perspective, but it also positively impacts those around you promoting an atmosphere of appreciation and warmth. Your thankfulness can create ripples of goodwill, encouraging others to express their gratitude too. 
Number seven, the joy of resilience. Life is inherently full of challenges, and our response to these hurdles shapes our experiences. Complaining often serves as a crutch. Venting may provide momentary relief, yet it seldom leads to real change. Instead of succumbing to a victim mentality, we should train ourselves to see challenges as opportunities to develop resilience and fortitude. Viktor Frankl, a Holocaust survivor and psychiatrist, believed, when we are no longer able to change a situation, we are challenged to change ourselves. This encapsulates the tenet that our attitudes dictate our emotional well-being. Rather than dwelling on what we cannot change, focus on how we can respond to life's challenges. Shift your mindset toward the idea that obstacles are opportunities for growth, which can significantly enrich your outlook. Implement proactive measures to improve your situation. For instance, when faced with difficulties at work, instead of dwelling on frustrations, consider the actionable steps you can take to navigate the road ahead. By fostering resilience, you enable yourself to thrive amid adversity. Practice reframing your thoughts. Instead of saying, I have to do this, say, I choose to do this. This simple change can eliminate feelings of being overwhelmed and empower you. Resilience isn't just about reacting positively. It's about reflecting on our lived experiences and taking lessons from them. Each challenge presents a chance to learn about yourself and discover your strengths. Over time, cultivating a mindset of resilience enables a deeper confidence that can provide a foundation for future challenges. As the journey unfolds, embrace the philosophy of selective silence. Not every thought or feeling needs immediate expression. Take time to reflect deeply. This inward focus can lead to greater clarity in our relationships and a richer understanding of ourselves. Emphasizing that silence can be an ally rather than a void allows deeper aspects of introspection to flourish. In a world filled with noise and relentless chatter, finding moments of quiet mindfulness can result in massive shifts, leading to greater comprehension of both our inner selves and the world around us. By intentionally choosing when to speak and when to listen, we provide ourselves the opportunity to understand more profoundly and to connect with those around us with greater empathy and awareness. Additionally, having the skill to discern when to hold back words can foster patience and wisdom. Moments of silence allow emotions to settle, encouraging us to think before we speak, leading to more thoughtful and impactful conversations. A practical exercise to incorporate selective silence into your life is to consciously dedicate time each day to be alone with your thoughts. Use this time to meditate, journal, or simply observe your surroundings. This practice can provide the clarity necessary for navigating life's complexities. As you grow accustomed to these moments of reflection, you will likely find that your insights about both yourself and your relationships deepen significantly. The art of silence can serve as a potent teacher guiding us to listen more attentively to our inner thoughts and the world around us. It enables us to recognize the value of stillness, a precious space where wisdom often emerges. Silence grants us room to contemplate our choices and gain insights that might otherwise be drowned out by the noise of constant chatter. In conclusion, cultivating wisdom through discretion is a journey worth embarking upon. By focusing on positive self-talk, emphasizing the value of listening, embracing gratitude, and navigating life's uncertainties with grace, we can nurture ourselves and our connections with others. Silence, too, 
can be a vital companion on this path. Through careful reflection, we take steps toward a life of clarity, compassion and resilience, living mindfully in the present moment and welcoming the opportunities it presents. Now that we've explored these critical insights, let's consider practical ways to incorporate these lessons into our daily lives. Understanding the theory is one thing, but applying it is where true transformation occurs. Let's delve deeper into the aspects of daily living that can benefit from these principles. 1. Start your day with affirmations. Begin each morning with affirmations that frame a positive outlook. Take a few minutes to recite affirmations that resonate with you. For example, expressing sentiments like, I am worthy of success, and I can handle any challenge that comes my way, can set a powerful tone for your day. Doing so consistently fosters a habit of self-love and acceptance, grounding your approach to each day. Second practice, mindful eating. To foster moderation, intentionally practice mindful eating. This method involves engaging fully with the experience of eating, savoring each bite and recognizing the colors, textures and flavors of the food. Diminishing distractions, such as screens or multitasking, while eating can enhance your appreciation for meals and promote a healthy relationship with food. 3. Engage in regular reflection through journaling. Incorporating reflection through journaling enhances your capacity for selective silence. After each day, take time to reflect on your experiences, feelings and thoughts. Document moments you're grateful for challenges you've faced, and how you handled them. This practice not only clarifies your emotions, but also highlights areas for growth and acknowledgement of successes. 4. Create a Gratitude Jar Cultivate gratitude in a tangible way by keeping a gratitude jar. Throughout the week or month, Write down moments or experiences for which you are grateful on small pieces of paper. When you need a boost or a reminder of the positives in your life, pull out a few notes from the jar and reflect on those moments. This practice nurtures a habit of appreciation, allowing you to see the good even during challenging times. 5. Establish quiet times. Incorporate quiet times throughout your day dedicated to silence and listening. Whether it's five minutes before work, during lunch, or as you wind down at the end of the day, allow yourself space to breathe and reflect. Use this time to practice mindfulness or engage in light meditation, simply observing your thoughts without judgment. This time can have a rejuvenating effect grounding you amidst the bustle of daily life. 6. Limit exposure to noise. In our hyperconnected world, noise can easily invade our lives. Be proactive in limiting media consumption or social media engagement that promotes negativity or overwhelming information. Curate your digital environment by choosing uplifting content and be intentional about the messages you expose yourself to. 7. Seek conversations that matter. Strive to engage in conversations that move beyond the superficial. Ask questions that invite meaningful exchanges, encouraging others to share their thoughts and experiences. What's something you learned recently that really stuck with you? Or, what challenges have you overcome this past year? Open doors to deeper discussions and connections. By integrating these practical strategies into your life, you deepen your connections with yourself and with others. 
These lessons guide your journey, promoting a profound understanding of the beauty in discretion and silence. As you navigate your life's path, you'll cultivate resilience, foster gratitude, and build lasting relationships, ultimately leading to a life filled with wisdom and inner peace. In today's fast-paced world, finding moments for reflection and connection is more important than ever. By embracing the principles discussed, you can nurture the inner strength that allows you to navigate challenges with grace and resilience. In this way, you transform not only your life, but also the lives of those around you, creating a ripple effect of positivity that extends far beyond your own experiences. As we conclude our exploration of the wisdom found within discretion and silence, let us remember that each day offers us a fresh opportunity to practice these lessons. Life is a continuous journey, constantly unfolding in ways we often cannot predict. Embrace the nuances of your path, the joys, the difficulties, the moments of silence, and the echoes of wisdom that resonate when you choose to listen. From affirming your self-worth and practicing moderation, to cultivating gratitude and nurturing connections, each step you take contributes to a richer, more meaningful existence. Integrate these lessons into the fabric of your life and allow them to guide you, shaping not only the way you see yourself, but also how you engage with the world and the people around you. Through patience and practice, you will likely find that these principles lead you toward a life filled with authenticity, strength and serenity. Embrace the art of discretion, cherish moments of silence and embark on the remarkable journey of self-discovery. Your story is unfolding beautifully Trust the process, and may it be a source of inspiration for yourself and others. By internalizing these teachings, you will cultivate a greater appreciation for the journey you are on. The lessons learned can be profound and transformative, creating a lasting impact on your life and the lives of those around you. Whether you are seeking self-improvement, deeper connections or inner peace, the practices shared here are stepping stones toward a life defined by wisdom, compassion and thoughtful presence. As you step forward into the world, remember that the power of reflection, gratitude and listening can change the course of your life. Embrace these principles fully and you'll navigate your journey with purpose and clarity impacting not only your path, but also the lives of many others whom you encounter along the way.